Welcome back! We have found a place in the forest where we are being watched by envious eyes? No. Um, let's see if we can talk to whoever is watching us. Hello? Who's there? I say, who's there? Please help me. Please? Uh, oh, never mind. Okay, well that didn't work. Graham can plainly see the eyes, but he can't quite reach them through the thick foliage. Hmm. If only we had some way to lure whoever is there out of there. Perhaps the emeralds would work. This is again a, a situation where I think the only way you can really figure this out is by trying everything, but anyway. Okay, some kind of elf or leprechaun or something. But since they're a bit too quick, we can't uh, quite catch them. Let's try that again. Not on the frog. I can't even try to catch them. Maybe we can trap them, however, using some sticky honey. Graham squeezes the honeycomb as hard as he can, which causes the honey to drip out of it onto the ground, creating a sticky little puddle at his feet. Now all that's left of the honeycomb is a piece of beeswax, which Graham puts back in his pocket. And our final emerald... And he fell for it, idiot. Please, let me go. I beg of you. Why should I do that? What will you do for me? I'll show you the way out of the forest, if you let me go. How do I know I can trust you? I give you my word. An elf never breaks his word. Well, it's against my better judgment, but... Okay. Move over, Rocky. You're in our way. Well, that's weird. <laughs> Sorry. You know, the only um, proof we have that elves always keep their word is his word. So, that really doesn't mean much. Still, it's our best chance of getting out of here. So let's follow him. <coughs> follow me! In here! This better not be a trap. Warning. This cartoon contains material that may be necessary for information. Of course, we want to watch the cartoons. Oh, we go underground. Some interesting fossils around here. This is interesting. Looks like they're mining something. I never take anything without giving in return. For your generosity in giving me those exquisite emeralds, I give you my finest pair of shoes. May they help you in your quest. Thank you very much for all your help. I'm sure I'll be able to find a use for these fine shoes. 
I never give anything without giving anything... I never take anything without giving something in return. My arse! If we hadn't trapped him with the honey, he wouldn't have given us shit. Little hypocrite. What a way for a duck to travel. Underground. Hey! Oh, I'm glad to see you're okay. I was beginning to worry. You were right not to want to venture in that dark forest, Cedric. I thought I'd never get out of there alive. Yeah. You can actually go back and come back uh, out this way, or you can go back in this way, although the uh, elves themselves are gone, if you try that. So in case you missed the uh, heart, or the key or something, you're not stuck at this point. Speaking of that heart, let's give it back to its rightful owner. this old thing anymore. <laughs> Look at me, I'm a princess again. Herbert! Alicia. Where have you been all this time, my love? Oh, darling, just take me home. I'll tell you on the way. And then they both died in the desert. Good thing he was waiting just off screen. Um, why would she throw away that harp? Now why would she toss aside this beautiful harp? Well, if she doesn't want it, I'll take it. Things have gotten a lot smaller. I mean, it was almost as big as Graham was when uh, it was still in the hands of the tree. Can we play the harp? Having learned to play the harp long ago, Graham now plays beautifully. Indeed. Although, apparently, we're not allowed to hear that. He just strums it once, which doesn't exactly equate to playing beautifully. Hey, look! The uh, gypsies have departed. It seems they left something behind, though. A tambourine lies on the ground near the abandoned gypsy encampment. A tambourine! <coughs> or collecting quite, uh... The orchestra. Not seeing the tambourine's owner, Graham bends down and rescues it from the ground. Can we play the tambourine? Almost looks the same as the custard pie, but anyway. Graham hits and shakes the tambourine with much ruckus but finds it doesn't accomplish anything. Oh well, we'll find a use for it uh, soon enough. Oh, well, let's see if the uh, gnome is interested in that spinning wheel we found. I have a feeling he might be. Also, those shoes, maybe the uh, shoemakers in town will be uh, interested in that. Where did you get this? I thought I had lost it. Oh, is it yours? I found it in the old witch's house in the dark forest. So that's where it got to. The old hag took it, eh? You know, this ain't an ordinary spinning wheel. It's not? Well, what's so special about it? I think I can guess. Why, this spinning wheel can spin straw into gold, that's what. Except you've got to know who to use it. 
I doubt even the witch could figure that out. Thank you for bringing it back to me. Oh wait, not so fast. How about that marionette? Don't you think the price of the spinning wheel is worth at least twice that of the puppet? I'd love to have it. Yeah, I guess so. Boy, give that marionette to the man here. I'll make you a new one. Come on, boy. Let's gather up some wood for a new puppet. And another person helped, and we got a marionette from the deal, which the toy maker in town might be interested in. I want to go by here, because somehow I feel I might be a little bit more lucky searching the uh, haystack this time. Graham watches with surprise as a contingent of ants marches into the haystack and begins to swarm through it. There was a way that we could be of help to you. Look here. We found a golden needle in the haystack. I'd like to present it to you. Perhaps you can find a use for it. Why, thank you, King Antony. I'm honored. Good luck in your travels, King Grim. And be careful. Well, let's not do that again. But hey, we got a gold needle. Hmm, the tailor in town might be interested in that. So we now have something for each of the three shops in the, in town, so I guess we should head back there. But actually, I guess we should do that in the next video.